This is Jennifer Whitaker with the Press Enterprise and PE.com reporting from Riverside. Linda and Gary Woodward love to dress their three chickens in costumes and put their photos on a Christmas calendar for friends and family. Well, the first year we only had like 10 copies made and we were just going to give them to our kids and then us. But we wound up having to have 60 copies made because everybody saw it wanted one. The couple says the chickens don't mind at all. As long as you're holding them, your feet aren't touching the ground, you can do anything you want to with them. You can dress them, uh, you can lay them on their back, they won't move. Uh, they're just really calm as long as you're holding them. Uh, but if you put them down, they'd go crazy yeah. with the clothes on. They'd be flopping all over the yard. It's, it's fun to dress them up. and, and that, As long as you're holding them, they're like, oh well, just do it. <laughs> The idea to dress the birds came about four years ago. It's our kids act like they're jealous of the chickens. You know, it's, they're all grown. And then our daughter, one time, we went to a family funeral, and my daughter and I got home. She says, oh, did you show pictures of the grandkids? I said, no, I forgot to take any. And she says, did you take pictures of the chickens? And I said, well, they were in the car. <laughs> so that's even got it going more. So we thought, well, how funny. We'll just make a family calendar, only with none of our kids, just the chickens. <laughs> Teresa Garbe is helping the couple make costumes. Though she has never sewn for animals of any kind before, she has quickly found a few rules for designing for chickens. I didn't finish this one. Uh, to keep it open in the back, basically. To keep it open in the back because you can't pick up their wings. So I put arms on them so they can appear to have arms. It was fun. I was just smiling the whole time. It was, it was a great thing. Inspiration is found all around, from vacations to Mexico to a trip to the Fox Theater to see Gone with the Wind. And Linda was really kind of disappointed with Ensenada. She didn't really care for it that much. And then she started seeing chicken clothes. You know, they were, I think they were doll clothes. And uh, she started seeing them. And then she got, she was became really inspired looking for for chicken clothes. You know? <laughs> All of our friends say we have way too much time on our hands. For the Press Enterprise and PE.com, this is Jennifer Whitaker.